Welcome back, folks. We are now making a decent amount of money again. Uh, so that is nice. And that is because this refinery is now basically maxed. It's because of this. It took a little while, but we are now maxed on production over here. So that is great. And that means that we have a lot more... Uh, oil coming up here which means we can make more goods and so on and so forth so first things first we need to upgrade these trains uh, to be a lot faster uh, we also have a lot of plastic sitting here they can't keep up and they're slowing down our oil trains which isn't good and this oil train is empty which is unfortunate but there's 261 oil sitting here waiting so it left just before it came down i guess uh, but that is the way it is. Where are you going? Oh, you're going down here. I keep mixing these two lines up. Um, okay, so manage vehicle. We need to upgrade those. And we're replacing them with the 4.12.2 class 9000 and it's pretty cool this is a new thing that we can do we can filter here and we could type so we can say goods uh, I thought we could type uh, type um, oh okay well we can't type but we can select uh, something like plastic 45 variants of this which is pretty cool but we can make a train that looks a little bit more uh, like it's uh, a mix of things which I like uh, we'll take the Rio Grande Oops. Okay, that was the New York Central. That's fine. Uh, we'll take those. So we're up to 274 meters. It's mediocre now. Capacity of 288. I actually need to see how many wagons do you have on? Uh, so you have 24. And your capacity is... 288 so that's what we're going for 288 replace steam uh, there cargo and we'll take some of these Okay, so that's 144 capacity. It's 216. 252. 288. Replace those for 60 million. But I like that. They're like that. That looks really nice. With different wagons. Okay. Uh, let's let time roll on. But I don't know why it's only mediocre. Because this one is... Good. I guess the others are heavier. For some reason. That's okay. I think this will be fine. So this has uh, top speed of 100, 160. And these have a 
top speed of Eighty, eighty, and sixty-four. Isn't this the four, twelve, two, nine thousand? Yeah. Ah, it's because of the wagons. These wagons can't go as fast, I guess. Uh, it's this one. It can only go eighty now. Yeah. Okay, so maybe I should have used these, but it's fine, it's fine. So that's all good. And you got 288 plastic for this guy. And he is out, so... But we are also using a lot of the uh, steel. We had more than a thousand steel stored up. 1.9 million for that little bit. And you're getting... How many goods? 90? Okay. That's not bad. That's not bad. We have you coming up with 264 oil. And we have 249 oil sitting here waiting. So that's nice. Uh, this over here is struggling a bit to keep up. And it's because it's not getting enough crude. So what I'm thinking of doing, this uh, oil well here, I'm thinking of sending it up this way. So these uh, trains here, after dropping off the oil, can come down here, pick up some crude, and send it down here to send over here. Because the ships are sailing kind of half empty a lot of the time, or half full, whichever way you want to put it. So you've got 108, you've got 71. But yeah, we, we could use more crude here. Ooh, and uh, this is cool. We can now upgrade tracks, and there is actually a high-speed track with electrified third rail. But and I and I upgrade it down here. Uh, it still puts in catenaries, so it doesn't really matter that it's a, a, a third rail because the catenaries are there. Uh, I suppose if we say no catenary then they won't be there, and maybe it'll work. We'll try that on a next line we build. Not this one, though. I do have more trains that I want to upgrade, though. I want to upgrade these trains, uh, because they are really struggling going up. But I think they're... Their capacity is fine, it's just they're, um, they're, they're not powerful enough uh, locomotives. Uh, it's the 442 Atlantic. Okay, USA 160, USA S160, WD Gray, the Douglas C49 Skytrain, and the Twin Coach. Nice. So our lines should start making more money. This uh, Murieta and Santa Rosa thing is not making a great deal of money. It's actually losing around 8 million, 9 million. And the commuter isn't making a lot of money yet either. The Provo Plastic 
goods to Juliet Port should start making money now. And uh, El Paso goods to Roseville and food back isn't making a lot of money either. sitting here and let's upgrade these and I think we want the Tapolins because we were transporting both the food and and oil. Ooh, we actually have quite a lot of goods sitting here. Let's... Um, extend this a bit. How many vehicles do we have on this? Six. Let's put three more on there. That'll hopefully help. Paso is a big town. Well, yeah, that's pretty big too. 475. Santa Rosa, 454. Olaith, 404. Robo is getting a little bit bigger as well, which is nice. So I guess the train station doesn't actually capture all of it now, but almost. All right, let's build this um, so we need a cargo terminus it certainly needs to be 320 meters Oof. look at it digging in there is the Elevation, really? So, doesn't look like it's that much. I suppose it is. Right, let's get you in there. And then, uh, tracks. So, this is new as well. It's very nice. And we'll say no to the catenaries. Um, I wonder where this will come out. It doesn't really look like it's getting shallower, does it? Let's... It would be coming out up here. Okay. I kind of want it to come over this way. Hmm. We want to cut a swath through that. I don't think so. one million I'm not super happy about this tunnel but it is what it is you can't do this so it's not it is it isn't what it is we need to find another way
We need to find another way. What's that? Uh, oh, there's a there's a tiny bit of rail in there. All right, so let's try and bulldoze this road. Buildings. If we put it in like this, it's much better. I think. Need a road. Come out this way. And then we can put this in. Uh, that seems better, right? So that we can get up and level. straight for a short bit so that we can do this and then we'll come around you know, we'll keep it at a 90 Okay, it looks like we're getting the level now. Good. All right. And then straight. Let's just build one of them. First, okay. we come up here. you to connect with this. Why won't you do that? Um, there we go. And then I want you here and connect with this and then I want signals I want signal here signal here I want signal here and then Auto signal all the way down there and auto signal all the way up and have a signal down here. All right. 
And then, of course, we need this road. Come out and connect up there. And we need to connect this road up again. So where was it, was it connected to? Oh, there. Let's just try and connect it up. Like that. And... We'll run all of this into that kind of road. Just so it kind of looks complete. All right. Okay. So that means that we need to, let's pause for a second. So it's going Jolia Distribution Hub to Lower Provo uh, to Fargo and then Joliet Distribution Hub. Yeah. All right. Where are you going to go? Where are you going? You please go. I think we're going to need another train, at least probably two more trains on this line. Let's clone one right now. It's coming from up here. How much are you going to get? 166 plastic, okay. And you have oil, so just a matter of time. 31 goods sitting here. You are out of steel now. So that's a problem. That means that we need to replace these trains. And I think we'll... So this one, 1,305, This one is much, much better. That one is insane, but it's also incredibly expensive to run. So we'll go with the 442, or 4122. Four, four Not the 442, that's the Iwatha. And then we need uh, steel. Well, this one. And we'll go with a capacity of 288. Replace. Okay. We're not getting enough coal, it looks like. Uh, we only have one train on this. We might need some more coal. 
Uh, we need some more coal. So let's replace you. Cargo type with that, and then cargo. We want coal, the gondolas, and we'll go up to the radiate there. That should be better. All right. Are you producing? No? That might just take a little while before it... As it comes down here and should be able to load it onto here. Getting 143. Oh, uh, you need to be able to uh, at Joliet Distribution Hub. You need to be able to unload all. Yeah. Uh, is it, was that the wrong train? It's this one. Uh, Joliet Distribution Hub. Unload that. And then in Fargo, you load that. Okay, now you should start producing. Yep. Okay. Good, 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 good. Comes 288 oil. You were out, so. Okay, and we have 159 plastic sitting here, 160, 161, going up, there's 71 goods, you're out of steel, but hopefully that will be remedied, we're only bringing 79, how much steel do we have sitting here, 70, this needs to go up. We might need to replace these trains as well. What's uh, what's the rate? 520 for that. What's your rate? 1,069. So yeah. We're definitely going to need to speed up the... Uh, The uh, what's it called? It's the ore, iron ore. All right. So it's getting ready to level up, which is great. All right. Completely dry on steel. Right, you have 120 crude. All right.
Do -do 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 -do. Are we making money? We are. Some. There's tons of iron ore sitting here. And there should... Coal production should go up. Oh, it's producing at 1200 now, so... It shouldn't really go up. That made 2.5 mil. How much is this the coal train gonna make? 1.8 mil. We have 120 steel, so it's better. And you're almost ready to go up. You have a lot of coal stored now as well, which is wonderful. We just need to save up a bit for the um, the upgraded uh, iron ore trains. All right, let's take a look at our lines. This one is still losing tons of money for some reason. Marietta commuter is losing money. Marietta steel to goods. Losing money, but that will be remedied. Provo plastic the goods to Juliet port is losing money, but that should be remedied as well. Uh, El Paso is losing money. But I think that'll be remedied again. What are our good lines? Santa Rosa, crude oil transfer. Uh, it uh, should actually be Santa Rosa crude oil to Santa Rosa. But that is making a lot of money. Uh, Joliet Iron Ore to Steel is doing well. Joliet Port Oil to Plastic is doing well. The Paso Oil to Fuel to Harbor is doing well. All right. We're doing all right. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 96 crew do you have? I think this needs to level up. Maybe we're not shipping enough. Maybe we need another train on here as well. I think we do. A 1.77 mil there. That's not bad. And picking up full train. Nice. Here comes another idle train. I think no, nope, that's uh There's one. 240. How much is sitting here waiting for it? 120. Okay. The Douglas DC4 and the 4884 Big Boy. It's a big boy. Okay, so 120 oil. It's a lot better than it was. 120. 120. 8 Okay So this is basically ma maxed out which is fantastic and Yeah, you're definitely dropping on the 
iron ore side now but you have up your production and you will again which is great so we have 115 steel sitting here waiting now and you are bringing up 168 good good it's good for the goods and you are just gonna run out of steel but here comes a new shipment for almost three mil not bad How many goods did you pick up? 108. That's going to get better. Because this is going to go up to... Max production, I guess. 188 crude. 60 sitting there. Three million there. All right, we have a lot of oil sitting here now. So yeah, we definitely need to clone the oil train. Let's do it. We have oil coming in here. Yeah, fifty. Not great. Still make it made a million though. Well, that's pretty good. Alrighty. We're gonna get more than two hundred plastic. Fantastic. Plastic, fantastic. And you're getting steel now. This is wonderful. This is wonderful. 28 million we made there. All right. How are we looking for passengers here? Well, going to Provo a lot. Well, Provo or Olaith. Let's go four or five. Virginia Beach, 15. That's not too bad. Uh, Santa Rosa, two, three, I guess you just picked up, yeah, you're full, 57, and you just picked up, 18, that's not the greatest, 29, oh, we're missing a couple of houses here, that's fine. So, I think next time we will we'll fix up the iron ore trains because you, you are well, you're out of both now. Well, coal is coming in, but so yeah, we need to fix up the iron ore trains. And then maybe we'll start building a commuter from Temecula to Green Bay to Memphis. Maybe. Maybe. But I just, I really want to take a look at uh, this train. Because I think it's cool that uh, it has these different uh, kinds of wagons on it. 
I think that looks really cool. I think that looks really cool. Oh. Don't you think it looks cool? I think it looks cool. Oh, that's nice. But anyway, we are out of time. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.